sorry. It's okay. Oh, God, it's getting colder. I know it is. Oh. What's wrong, your hip? No, my toes. Right, let's just wiggle them. Moving them makes the oh. blood flow, okay? I know it hurts just the warm blood hitting the freezing nerves, but it's a good hurt because it means the body's still sending blood to that area. Yeah, yeah. Okay. How are you staying awake? I just do. You could keep going, can't you? Not tonight. Oh, Jason, you can't keep on doing this. You know, you can't keep carrying me all day and then staying awake all night, especially with no food. We'll be okay. Do you think our chances would be better if you went on alone? Mine would. I don't think yours would be. I need you to do me a favor. Do Robin a favor. All right. Leave me here. trying to have to dry at some point. When they dry, I am going to build the biggest fire you've ever seen in your life. And I'm going to send up smoke signals and Jax is going to see him and he's going to come down here and save us. Shouldn't you be gone by now? What are you still doing here? I'm just looking for food. There's no way anyone's going to be able to find us unless the conditions change. That's why you need to go and get help. That's why I thought you were going. Did I say I was going? No, we just left without saying anything, but I just assumed you were going to get help. Brenda, me leaving you alone is not the solution. Jason, do you have a better idea? Because I am so sick of eating berries, and my hip hurts, and I'm freezing. That's a really good idea. You can go and find help and come back here and save me. And then all of our problems will be solved. Or more problems are going to be created. They don't work. <sighs> Listen, I'm okay here by myself. I swear to God I am. My hip's not broken. It's just, it's sore and it's, it's already feeling better. And I, I, I'm okay. And you're lying to me. I'm not. Why do you always do this to me? Why are you trying to protect me? You know, even when we were back in Port Charles. I always felt like you were watching me all the time or having someone who worked for you watch me. And why are you doing that? Because Sonny told you to? Jason. We could die here. This could be your last chance to be honest with me about something. And you have no idea how much I need to know this. And you're the only person who can tell me. Did Sonny leave me because he loves me? I know that was you.
Jax, I can feel him. Can, can't you still hear the helicopter moving? Listen to that. Listen to that. Those are echoes. They're bouncing no, off the mountain. No, it's not. That was him. He would never come this close and not be able to feel me. I know that. I know that that was him. He's gonna... Well, he's what? One of your little magic fairy tale people? Yes, he is, and he would never no, give no, up no. on we me. We don't even know if it was Jax, okay? If so, he did what he could. We did what we could, and it didn't work out. We're lucky that we have matches. Maybe we can start a fire tomorrow night. No, we are not staying here tomorrow night. We have a box of wet matches. I am tired. I am freezing, and we have no flares left. Okay, fine, whatever. Listen, if you're so sure that that wasn't Jax, then you go and you get help like I asked you to, all right? And I'm going to stay right here because I know okay, this, that he'll be back for me. Just shut up. This is a bad time to get crazy, okay? I'm not insulting your boyfriend. I'm telling you what I know. When I was looking for Michael, I did everything I could think of. Everything. I hoped. Hope cannot save us. The sooner you learn that, the better off we'll be. Sorry I got so mad. You know how you said that you were looking for Michael and you didn't find him at first, but you just didn't give up. That's how Jax feels about me. He won't give up. You want to try and get some sleep? I want to be awake when he gets here. The helicopter was close. I'll bet you. Bet me? That Jax is going to show up here tonight. Find me. Why? We're going to survive whether Jax finds us or not. There's nothing to bet on. You're so sure we're going to survive? That's why you won't tell me anything about Sonny. Because it would be a betrayal. I want you to know that no matter what you tell me, I'm not going to look for him. I don't want to find him. I just need so much to understand why he did that to me so I can go on. Will you tell me if he left me to save me? Help me out. I want to look at the sky. The helicopter's long gone. There's nothing to see. You need to rest. You're it. Still alive. Yeah. Close enough. Oh my god, did you just hear that? I heard it. Jax! 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 Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh. We uh saw the flare, but we couldn't land, so we sit down and wait up. You ready to go, huh? Yeah. <laughs> Something wrong, Grandfather? Well, I have my great-grandson back. That should be enough to make any man happy. But you're not. It's Jason, isn't it? I've done so many things wrong with Jason. Didn't show it very often, but uh, I loved that boy. And I'd give anything to have a second chance to try to make things right. I'm afraid that would take a miracle. Hey, hey, hey. Jason. Where's Michael? Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. 
I missed you so much. Is Brenda okay? Yeah, yeah, she's okay. She banged her head up. She's in the hospital. How's Michael doing? Oh, he's fine. I'm, I'm sorry for letting them bring Michael here, but he's fine. At least you were here with him. Where is he? He's upstairs. He needs you. Don't you touch that child. You hear me? You're a disgrace. You're a poor excuse for a human being, and you're unfit to father a child. See ya. Hey, for what it's worth, you didn't really need to kick the door in because Emily and I never would have allowed this family to hold on to Michael. It's good to know. Jason, you should call Carly. I'm taking Michael up to see her as soon as I get changed. Emily, thanks for taking care of him. I loved it. I love him. See you soon, Michael. Jason, I... I tried to take care of Michael. I never intended to steal him from you. He doesn't belong here. I thought about you while I was away, but you knew that already. I knew the quartermains would move on you. I'm sorry you had to stay with them. You know, the night the plane crashed, I promised myself I would come back to you. And here I am. Now we're going to see about getting Carly back to you, okay? Come on in. Yo. How's he doing? He's good. How you doing? Fine. Words out now, not even a plane crash can keep you out of commission for long. Of course, the smart boys were uh, figuring on that all along. What about Carlos? Does he know what happened? Yeah, I had to, I had to tell him when I called to postpone the casino meeting. Reschedule. I'm flying down there tonight. You're going to San Juan on a plane? You got a faster way? <laughs> yeah, I just, you know, after what well, happened. Yeah, Benny, it was an accident. I survived. It's not going to stop me from doing what I have to do. And she tried to get Michael back from the Quartermains, which didn't go over real well with her buddy Monica, you know. <laughs> Look, I'm not saying we're going to be entering the three-legged race on family day. But it felt okay, right? Yeah, it felt uh, real okay. Considering, I mean, I ruined the woman's life. It's nice of her not to hold it against me, isn't it? <sighs> Ned was here, too. He was, um, swearing that he would make sure that Michael didn't end up with the Quartermains for too long. And, uh, the rest of them, Jason, they're like vultures. They came after Michael the day after you disappeared. It's like they wanted you to be dead. Yeah, well, the Quartermains won't get Michael again. I have it in my will if something happens to me. Yeah, like then... what? Hmm? You survive everything. I hope you pass some of that strength on to Michael. God knows he's not going to get it from me. Carla, you're okay. Yeah? Now, look, you just have to hang on a little while longer. I made some progress in New York. Cashed in a few favors to get a judge on our side. And he can help us when the time comes. When is that going to be? Once the worst of the publicity dies down. You have to go so soon? Yeah, you know, I have to, I have to leave town. Business, 
Yeah, I get a meeting in Puerto Rico. Wow. Well, what about Michael? Actually, I, w I was going to take him with me, if that's okay. Yeah, of course. Please. He's safe with you, I know that. He's lucky to have you, Jason, so am I. I'll bring Michael back to see you soon. You hear that, Michael? Daddy's gonna bring you back to see me. Yes, he is. Oh, but first, you're gonna go to Puerto Rico. <laughs> and Daddy's gonna bring you back to see me just as soon as he can. Right, we will. <laughs> <laughs>